I had 24 hours to test it and I never did. So this is officially like my first test. And the disc tray works, that's great. Sweet. So I came down here. Uh, I don't know if you, there's, you probably can't see it. There's smoke. There's smoke coming out of my freaking, yeah, there's, see that little bit of smoke there? Come out of this Xbox. I accidentally just bumped it on and it started smoking. Holy sh! Now it's one spark. Do you see that or hear that? It's fucking scary, man. That's scary. I'm throwing this right out. Holy! F Be careful when you buy used electronics. Oh, that stinks. You know why. So uh, it's evening time. Would you get this for 10 bucks? It's huge. Anyways, I came back and they had a bunch of stuff here. So really interesting, but big. I don't know if I have the space for this at home, but who cares? But yeah, I did come back again twice in one day. It's not often. I get to go to the thrift store. I'm actually just on my way to... Uh, uh, post office, drop off some stuff for you guys, so. Alright, I didn't see any games. Let's just, uh, let's head home now. I don't know why, but like Burger King is lined up all the way up to here. Free Whopper Day or something? Jeez. And I don't know what it is, that impossible Whopper that they have. Twice I ate it, twice I yak like i something in it doesn't agree with my stomach or i got poisoned i don't know but i will never be ordering the impossible burger from burger king again stay away is my advice come here man look at that heat where'd you get such heat bro come here, of course. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Hey, those are my favorite shoes back in the day these are actually you know i was a two one of my favorites I don't like the look of it. So that was nice. Got to hang out with JJ. Fantastic. Hey, look, there's games today. Red Dead, Brother in Arms. Actually, don't own those games, so I'll just take them. Suban. Lineup wasn't too crazy today. Whatever I want for this. Mm. It feels really nice actually. It takes up a lot of room though. The showcase area, not the display area. I see a bunch of DVDs, but no games back there yet. Wow, that's a huge record, Ralph. <laughs> Lenticular chess. That's funny. Oh, I need some of these. Sadly, paying five bucks for it. Why can't it be one ninety nine? There's my thrifting partner. Yeah, like a machine, bro. You find anything? I'm not sure about this one yet. The Beatles. College, university, type of this one's my favorite. That's sick. 91? Yeah, great cup. <laughs> yeah, and the baseball jersey. All the Phillies. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Today was a pretty good day, though. Beautiful day. Glorious day. Thank you for joining me. Let's go back to the lab.
know why. This was the main stuff that I picked up today. I called it big thrifting because just the size of these items are really big. I got this uh, force feedback steering wheel for the Xbox 360. I tested it already and uh, works really good actually. It made playing a lot of those like Forza games and stuff that I own a lot more fun. And I kind of see the appeal of having some sort of uh, simulation machine like this. Uh, nice and smooth. The force feedback from the game was great. Connectivity was great. Responsiveness was great. I actually had to go back to the store to pick up this. I left it behind by accident. So uh, Valley Village was nice enough to just give it to me and not charge me for it, which was really cool. So yes, tested, working. I paid $14.99 for it. And I've seen this online. Um, selling for a variety of prices as cheap as like $40.00. And upwards of like $100 even without the box complete. So I'm going to price this somewhere around 60 bucks. I think that'll be fair. And surprisingly, these uh, Guitar Hero guitars wired for the Xbox 360. They're called Explorer, Explorer Controller. Red, red Octane guitars. I'm not too familiar with them. But like one of these sells for like 100 bucks, Give or take. I don't know. Canadian. So I have two of them here. I paid uh, an average of $6.99 for each of them. One was like $5.99. One was $7.99 for some reason. That is Big Thrift. And thank you very much for joining me on the channel. Hopefully uh, you enjoyed it. Again, uh, it's nighttime again me shooting this. So yeah, excuse the shirt. I really should get like a, a sweater that I just keep down here. Thank you very much for joining me on the channel. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Really, I do appreciate all the uh, new subscribers I've been getting lately. Head is shaved a little bit more. <laughs> Um, I got some feedback from some of the questions that I asked before. The main question being, do you like the, when I do a vlog at the thrift store, do you like the kind of like three or four days in one video? Or do you want like shorter, uh, one day visits to the thrift store? Cause mainly this channel is me going to the thrift store every morning. And I think the majority of people that I spoke to or the people who responded to me said that they like the shorter videos more. So I will continue with that. Also, thank you for, uh, Responding to the question, what movie do you think of when you hear the New Line Cinema intro? The number one answer was the Ninja Turtles movie. I might make a video about that. Thank you very much for joining me. This is Nate from Thrift World of Peace. Take care of yourselves and each other. Big thrift in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's my soldering kit. A lot of fun. I'm just practicing soldering on like old PCB boards and stuff like that. Anyways, that's it for me, Nate. It's late. Peace. Take care of yourselves and each other.